नमस्ते आई एम मंजुला वेलकम टू माय किचन टुडे आई विल बी मेकिंग पेड़ा पेड़ा इज ऑल टाइम फेवरेट स्वीट पेड़ा इज आर लाइक सॉफ्ट मिल्क फज कैंडी मेड विद मिल्क एंड शुगर फ्लेवर्ड विद कार्डमम पेड़ास कैन बी सर्व एज कैंडी और एज डिजर्ट दिस रेसिपी विल मेक ट्वेंटी फोर पेड़ास फॉर दिस रेसिपी वी नीड फोर कप्स ऑफ मिल्क वन थर्ड कप ऑफ मिल्क पाउडर अनादर वन थर्ड कप ऑफ मिल्क थ्री टेबल स्पून ऑफ अनसॉल्टेड बटर हाफ ए कप ऑफ शुगर वन फोर्थ टी स्पून कार्डमम पाउडर अबाउट वन टेबल स्पून ऑफ स्लाइस्ड पिस्टैचियोज टू गार्निश पेड़ास आर बेस्ट इफ यू मेक दम विद होम मेड पनीर आई हैव ऑलरेडी मेड दी पनीर विद फोर कप्स ऑफ मिल्क यू कैन सी ऑन माई वेबसाइट how to make paneer and this is about 1/3 cup of paneer for making peda first we need to make khoa to make khoa we need to mix paneer milk powder and milk together and cook on medium heat this is a very simple and easy recipe to make khoa heat is on medium so first i am going to melt the butter so after butter is melted add the milk milk powder and paneer and mix it together Yeah, after mixture comes to the boil it takes about 10 to 12 minutes to make khoa you do have to keep stirring this so it does not burn from the bottom and you do have to keep cleaning from the sides so it does not uh, build up uh, and get a little bit hard okay, this has been about Five minutes. It's uh, coming along really good, and it will take five to six more minutes. It should be a texture of dough, soft dough. So this has been about ten uh, minutes. Uh, we need to do little bit more, and just make sure when you are uh, cooking this that you keep mixing it uh, well. so khoa is uh, smooth so as you see it is coming together like a dough but we have to cook uh, maybe for another minute the okay, khoa is ready as you see it looks like a soft dough it took me about uh, 13 minutes so now i'm going to turn off the heat and let this cool down before we will add the sugar and cardamom powder okay khoa has cooled off to uh, just uh, slightly warm it's time to add the sugar and cardamom powder we don't add the sugar while uh, khoa is hot because uh, that way uh, sugar will melt and khoa will get very soft so we are going to add the sugar and cardamom powder and mix it together okay khoa is smelling good 
and the texture is looking really good. Khoa, it should be a little bit grainy in the texture. And like you see, it has come together like a dough. So divide the khoa into about 20 or 24 equal parts. Okay, now uh, roll them between your palms into the ball and just press it lightly or you can use the cookie cutter and uh, shape them any way you would like. You can smell the cardamom without cardamom my any of my desserts are not finished i'm going to garnish the pera with pistachios uh, while they are still moist and they can hold better The statues give them a nice color and make it look very festive. Pedas are looking great. This is an easy recipe to make and very tasty. You can keep this out uh, for about a week in a closed container or refrigerate for a month. I am going to take this to my friend's house for a get together and I am sure everybody is going to like it. I am going to see you again with a new recipe. Thank you.